<laughs> so y'all know Bart was here this past weekend. And he this this weekend here will be a weekend he will never forget because I think he said he had somewhere up around sixty. Let me shut my door here. Hang on just a minute. He had around sixty red bugs on each leg and one on his nut. When you have an experience like that, you don't forget where you got them from. So I'm gonna show y'all what I use right here. Hang on, let me spin the camera around. This repel. And see it'll last up to two weeks. Okay. The thing that you gotta look for is the active ingredient permethrin. P-E-R-M-E-T-H-R-I-N. That's what you need to you need to get. You can find this, well I'll order mine, but you can uh you can find this sometimes at Academy. Uh, Dick's will have it sometimes. I've seen it in Walmart too, but I'll make it easy on you. I get mine off of Amazon. You can, uh, I'll throw a link down there. But uh, the way this stuff works is, is if you do have a tick crawl up your pants leg, it'll, it'll smoke you. Or most of the time, well, I had a guy there yesterday tell me that, that he was even on his farm, he was using permethrin, and he said it wasn't even touching the ticks this year. So, but that's what I use, and it stays good for a while. You just cannot spray that stuff on your skin there, or you'll be in trouble. It will blister you if you put it on your skin. It says it right there. Big dummy. <laughs> That's what you get though, is that kind of old case of it right there. Trucks just went by me. It's pretty nice this morning, uh, 63 degrees here. I can tell yesterday afternoon it was a, uh, it was something changing. We don't usually have mornings like this from May through September or so where it's, where it's low humidity and not and real nice in the morning where you can where you can breathe pretty good so notice all the bark everywhere you look there's hardwood bark this pile here is just solid bark interlaced in all that pile the road and i scoot see there's a pile right there see this pile right here i raked up all this right here this bark off these poplars is insane man coming off the oak it's very aggravating to fool with, too. Mm -mm -mm. It's lunchtime. It's always fun when you're up on a high bank like this. This in here is about five feet tall, I guess. Up on it. it puts you up a lot higher than the truck. A while ago when I said uh, lunchtime, ended up having two more trucks come back, so I went ahead and loaded them right quick. Now we're about to eat. What's well, the last part of this track right here is rough. I mean, it's got a, that's a deep, deep hole right there. Derek's working down toward right now. He's getting that. So you got Hunter here cutting the grass today. Yes, he does get paid to do it. A lot of people ask me that, but he does. We've had uh, an incredible amount of rain. He just cut it last week. Well, it's been a little, a week and just a couple of days. And look at how thick that stuff is. Looks good, though. He's cutting it. He's down there. Yeah, on my John Deere Zero turn. Now Jill just got home. Supper. Uh, and you got supper. Good. So to ride or not to ride? That is the question. <laughs> yes. Yeah. All right. You bring something good home? I hope so. Good. You better. I didn't have to cook it, so uh -huh. that's all that all counts. Right. You have to earn your keep, woman. 
You think so? Oh, and got the wedge banger right here. Came in today from Ed and Jennifer. I'm not going to flip it over so y'all can't see their address, but uh, I'll be opening it in a little bit. We are about to chow down over here. We got one of these yard birds. These things are good, man. I like them. Those little rotisserie chickens. Supper Walmart style. Supper Walmart style. Cool. Mm -hmm. Look. Very good. So that's what we're what we're about to do. What in the world? I think somebody just kicked something in the kitchen in there. I think Jill may have just broke her toe. I'm not sure. But anyhow. So this is the uh wedge banger axe right here from Jennifer and Ed. Stevens that they sent me. Y'all remember last week I did the unboxing of uh, this uh, double bit axe that they sent me. This is for me right here. And then here is the other double bit axe that they sent me for the 40,000 subscriber giveaway. That giveaway is going to start this Sunday, this coming up Sunday. What sun, what day is that? Here, let me see here. <sighs> You'd think I'd be ready for this right here. It looks like it's the 10th, June the 10th. It's only gonna run for two days. The reason why it's only gonna run for two days, well, it's gonna run, it'll run that Sunday, Monday, and that Tuesday, which is the 12th, I'm gonna pick a winner for this ax. The reason why is, is because that next Sunday, the 17th, is Father's Day. And if I get the winner picked that Tuesday and get, get them contacted and everything, I can get this actually um, just shipping it regular mail, priority mail. They'll have it before Father's Day. And that's my goal. That's what I want to do. So you're only going to have till that Tuesday to win this axe right here. But anyhow, let's get down to other things. This is a shirt that Bart gave me the other day that has his stuff on it there. Uh, Cameron Logan that was here and visited with me. Uh, you can see the back of it right there. So appreciate that, Bart. And then Bart's wife makes these things like this right here. She makes a bunch of different stuff. Uh, her name is Kathy. And you can find her on... You can find her right there on Facebook. She, like I said, she makes all kinds of stuff uh, and puts it out to sell. So, Kathy, I do appreciate the plaque because I'm going to put it in here somewhere in here. All right, so we got that out of the way. Now we're going to open this axe here. Uh, not this axe. This is a wedge banger right here. He wanted me to have a wedge banger too. This comes from Jennifer and Ed Stevens. Their information to their YouTube channel will be in the top of the description box. Uh, Ed makes puts these axes together, custom does them, and they've got all. They got several videos showing what all they got. He's got tons of different axes to pick from and everything like that and you can go over there if you're interested in one of these you can go over there and pick you up one so he says uh here's your wedge bangers promise enjoy hope you like it ed and jen stevens all right the other stuff that they sent has been just bad at the bone. So this, this I have no doubt that this is going to be bad to the bone also. All right, now is the tricky part. Let me get to take, because when they ship these things, it's inside that cardboard. Plus, it's all wrapped up like this. So it's very well packaged up. Thing. Oh shoot, I hit myself. Get this thing in shape here right quick. 
He offers two different lengths on these wedge banger. A 28 and a 34, I believe it is, on these. And I opted for the 28. I didn't want the longer handle. I like the shorter one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This in here's got some character. I like that. I like that. I like what he does with the handles right here. On them. I do. Let's see. See who's snapping me right there. Did a really, really good job on this thing here. Cool. I am going to use this double bit axe here too, by the way. That'll be later on. I'm going to use it. So be standing by for Sunday, this coming Sunday's video for your opportunity to have a chance at winning this axe right here. Plus I'm gonna be giving away uh, one of my shirts, one of my Cotton Top 3 shirts also. Two that'll be given away. So it's gonna be pretty gonna be pretty good. I'll package it all up, and get it to you before Father's Day unless something crazy happens, you know what I mean? Because my plan is to get the drawing done uh, Tuesday and con immediately contact whoever whoever gets it and ship that thing to them at Wednesday and get it gone. So I don't want this drawing to, or this giveaway to run a week or nothing like that. I want to get it over and done with quick, get it out to them. So hope you enjoyed all that. Very different video today. Uh, which I like. I like different stuff. I like mixing it up, all kinds of different things. Uh, the demolition video of the Volvo uh, 700 excavator re went really, really well. All of my videos have done very, very well. Thanks to y'all for watching them. And I've got, uh, I'm going to try to make some contacts here on some other really cool stuff. So for now, I'm going to let y'all go and I'll, uh, I'm probably fixing to change clothes and go hop on my mountain bike and go put, I don't know, I'll probably only do about 12 to 15 miles today is what I'll do on it this afternoon. Cause we still got, uh, we still got two and a half hours before it gets dark. So all the clickable stuff's right down below. Like I said, go check out Jennifer and Ed's um, YouTube channel and subscribe to them. Uh, they're doing, they've already done one giveaway. They're gonna be doing some other giveaways. And all the other clickable stuff's right down below. We'll catch y'all later. Later, taters.